There is more to the color palette than simply selecting colors. Notice the eyedropper slash color picker tool at the left hand end of the color chips. With this you can select any color from one part of the design or from the vector artwork and fill it to another object using the bucket tool. Notice as you pass over an embroidered object a border appears identifying which object is about to be selected. A single left click selects a color and it becomes the active color. Now select the bucket icon and tip the active color to any object or objects you wish to change. Or simply select the color in the working palette to make it active and use the bucket to fill the active color to any object. The Cycle Used Colors tool will rotate through the colors and apply them to different objects. The Color Wheel will offer five schemes, Analogous, Complementary, Harmonious, Monochromatic and Triad. The base color that the other colors react to is indicated by a white ring around the node at the end of the color line. Left click and hold on the node and move to change the relationship of each color to the base color. To make another color the base color, double left click on the node of your choice. There is also a brightness scale at the bottom. Now you'll notice the color palette is now showing RGB colors. To match to your brand of thread, open the threads chart, select your brand of thread and match all. I hope this has helped and thanks for watching.